Hello and a warm welcome to Wembley Stadium here in London. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And with the league season about to begin, we have action coming up from the curtain raiser, the Community Shield. It's Arsenal facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, the Community Shield is always an interesting game just to see how these two teams are progressing. What might the coaches do differently? Are the players splitting up and will they be challenging for silverware once again this year? Well, Martin Erdegaard is supremely gifted and I wonder, Stuart, what role you think he'll play in this game? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him, his movement is excellent and in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. So the starting 11 for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the centrepiece of the attack today is Gabriel Jesus. And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Everson is the goalkeeper. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Jack Grealish plays with Phil Foden out wide. And the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland. And the match is underway. Diesch. Ake. couldn't keep the ball well, can do better in terms of the pass fine work from City to win the ball back tremendous ball played through And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Given away by City. Holland. On to Silva. Walker. And the cross into the middle. It could be up for grabs. And just offside, but by a whisker, my goodness. Diesch. Holland. And the keeper's hand does the trick. Gabriel Martinelli and Havertz and it's Gabriel Jesus he can't hold on to it and the keeper hangs on at the second attempt well he's done really well hasn't he great stop and then the reaction Walker Foden It. A really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Well, I have to say, City are so unlucky not to be leading now. They look a real threat at the moment. Well, they're on the ball, and they've just got to forget about that moment of misfortune. Foden. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Foden De Bruyne with options can they forge ahead oh he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal keeper has it now
given away by City. Kai Havertz. Marcinelli. And now with Havertz. Can they nudge in front? Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. No, high quality defending and he has options available Holland well the referee trying to play advantage there but it wasn't forthcoming well the referee letting him know any more like that and he will go into the book Stuart yeah, he knows he can't commit another foul now Martin Erdegaard, lovely ball over the top. Under real pressure defensively, will they pay the price? Well, what an opportunity squandered. Far too easy for the keeper. A wilting under the pressure, and now they try to go forward. Could cross it in here. The cross was very much on, but not the end result they were hoping for. Marcinelli. On to Zinchenko. Well, ruled to have taken up an illegal position only just. Walker just couldn't keep it. Holland. Moving forward effectively. And showing excellent vision. And the keeper tied in to thwart him. Firing is over. Struggling to get it away. John Stones. The ball with Rodri. Silva. No way through. City couldn't keep the ball. Well, as you can see, Arsenal haven't had that much of the ball. But their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. It's really good without the ball, and the all-around performance levels have been high. It opens up for Havertz. Still alive. Well, no damage done. Foden. Cross-fired over. Well, poor technique, and a goal kick coming up. Declan Rice. And they stopped them in their tracks. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. De Bruyne. Foden. who now have squared it well let's have another look because this is a goal they have thoroughly deserved they've played really well so far And the referee's whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium.
Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. Martinelli. It's with Erdogan. Chances on. In it goes! But it will not stand offside, Stewart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. Stones. It is advantage Manchester City here. Bernardo Silva. And return to De Bruyne. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, the good value for the lead. Well, here it is again, and just look how he turns away from his marker and then gets his shot away. That's a very good goal, you have to say. Well, underway again, it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. Martinelli. Arsenal could threaten from this position. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And it's a quality pass. Hold on. He's using his strength to good effect. Braine. It's Bernardo Silva. Well, we like to call things as we see them, Stuart, and I must say, he's got that one horribly wrong. Well, it's a poor decision in the end. It's way off target. Substitution time it is here. And teammates around him. Firing it towards goal. Oh, that's a fine save. Holland. Could play it in. Foden. It's going to be a city ball. Teammates in the middle. No nonsense clearance. Holland. the chance to give them a bit of breathing space well that should have made it more comfortable shouldn't it but it's a wasted opportunity Martin Erdegaard it did look on for them but not to be Walker on to Holland the ball with Rodri and Bernardo Silva has it. Foden. Excellent use of advantage from the referee in City's favour. Rodri. Back to Holland. A bit wasteful from City. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Can he finish? And he's certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat. He looks so sharp today. De Bruyne firing it over. Well, it was a crowded penalty area, but the keeper's done well to hold on to that. Went in strongly, decisively. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Sloppy in possession. Kevin De Bruyne. Given away by City. 
And it's Gabriel Jesus. And thwarted there following the cross. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. All hands on deck. Foden. Is it going to be? And now the goal the City fans wanted to see. It's hard to see them throwing this away. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Gabriel Jesus. Alexander Zinchenko. And it's Gabriel Jesus. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Could reduce the deficit. Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. Can they hit on the break? From one side of the pitch to the other. And now passing it through. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Jesus. It's with Gabriel. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Just needs to resolve the danger. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Rodri. Well, not the pass he had in mind. The conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, they profit from this situation. Well, it looks highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Well, the action is good, and he's in. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, here it is again, and they've taken their goal well, but the defending was non-existent. That should never happen. Scoreline 4 2. Rodri. Well, spot on with that challenge. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. And the yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Really good interception. And full-time, most satisfying, a victory in the curtain raiser to the season. Well, it's certainly a good way to start the season. That's just what they wanted. They played really well today, and it's always great to keep winning trophies.